Hi, this is Greg. Hi, this is Greg McIntyre with the Elder Law Report, and we're going to talk about how knowledge is power, how you can gain more knowledge and power, and be empowered to protect all your money and property for as much as possible. So, so Britain, um, you know, when I became an estate planning and elder law attorney, I made it my mission and knew I had a task to educate people on what an elder law attorney did and why it was so important because people don't know what they don't know. And one of the ways that you can get to know or be in the know or get more knowledge and power is to read, to watch educational content. We do a lot to help with that. That's right. Yeah. And the thing is, is, you know, we try to say, um, you know, everything that we want to say in, in, in chunks and then we repeat it. Okay. So, so we have our seminars, we have our books, we have our magazines, we have our videos, we have our elder law report. And I even do a morning show every morning called Latte with Lawyer. Because, okay. And we have a podcast. That's right. And so we have all this content going out because, um, not only do we want to give it, serve it in small chunks, right? How to eat an elephant one bite at a time, right? So elder law is like an elephant. There's a lot of information there and we want to give it to you one bite at a time. But the other thing is, is we repeat ourselves too, but in a different way, because it's good to hear things not only in one context, but in multiple contexts. So it really lands with you. And the other thing is things change. The law is an ever evolving thing. And, um, you know, Learning something is important, but staying in the know is another very, very important thing. And um, that's something that we've strived to do is to keep our clients in the know. I mean, what lawyers are able to do, what they've had for a long time is a monopoly on knowledge. And, you know, I don't think that that's the way to operate. We don't think that that's the, op the way to operate. We think it's best to, to educate our clients and to reveal to them clearly the best way to go rather than to hoard that knowledge, keep it for ourselves. And you pay me to get, you know, that knowledge and I'm not going to let it go freely. I'd rather you have the knowledge and for you to be convinced even before you come see me that um, you need to see an estate planner or elder law attorney. Absolutely. Absolutely. So you mentioned, I mean, you know, we break down complicated legal concepts simply in a straightforward manner. And then we loop some of that information. So we really get it. So we repeat it. And, and so, so we really understand it ourselves and we can communicate it to others. You know, sometimes I take content and draw it out as maps, right? Or yeah. steps. And we make it really visual for visual learners. Um, and just so you can understand the information in a different way. We work very hard to bring that information to you you can get that information on our website um, at mcelderlaw.com. Um, and also you can sign up for the e-newsletter on our website, mcelderlaw.com too. That's a great way to stay informed. If the law changes and your will, you know, your trust doesn't change with it, your estate plan doesn't keep up with it, then you're left behind in the past and you could really suffer. So stay up to date, stay tuned. You know, you don't have to read every email that, that we send out, but we'll make sure that we have in the subject line, you know, what it's about. And if it's relevant to you, pop that open and check it out because it could really affect your family and you for generations. That's right. That's right. So we keep you tuned in. And if, as long as you stay tuned in, you will be informed. Tune in hang out, be informed, and improve your situation That's and right. your chances of success. So thank you, Brenton. Knowledge is power. And That's we'll right. keep studying and, and putting out great information. See you next time on the Elder Law Report.